we continue the 2024 Scrub Daddy Summer Games. Round one is completed. That means we step into the exciting round two of the competition with the United States versus Poland. We have Italy versus Greece, Japan versus the United Kingdom, and Canada versus China. Today we'll concentrate in our quarterfinals with the USA against Poland. And we had great American food. You saw it. We had our hamburger, our hot dog, our french fries. And I mentioned earlier, the french fries are not actually from France. They're from the United States. But I, but I had one person who commented that, no, they're from Belgium. Did the person who said that have a lab coat? I don't think they did. Are you ready to get started? All right, set your clock. Three, two, one, go. All right, the key to cleaning, any solid waste, scrape it off into a trash container or go ahead and use your garbage disposal. Here is our dish daddy. Hot water makes that flex texture technology nice and soft and absorbent and sponge-like, so you have your cleaning on that rather quickly. The shape, unique as it is, allows you to get into even small areas of utensils, like our tongs that we used on our grill. That little happy face is perfect. Oh, it smiles at you. There's the knife, get that done quickly. Don't forget, one of the most important things to make sure you clean after every use is your cutting board. Food residue spoils quickly, so you wanna to get to that with hot water. This was our chocolate shake, that was good. That's probably our biggest mess. But the shape, again, allows you to reach into all of those areas and get even things like chocolate sauce, which is sticky and messy, quickly and easily. It's always fun when you do it from behind the sink. Nobody cleans this way at home. Now, one last thing to do, and that is my favorite scrub daddy tool. This is the barbecue daddy. Do not call it a grill daddy. That makes the owner of the company mad. Cold water, ice cold water, stainless steel. You're not cleaning with bristles. Bristles have never made food taste any better. And that is done. Two minutes, 30 seconds. That's pretty quick. Now let's see if Poland can compete with that time. Oh, things are heating up. Are we ready? Three, two, one, go. We had pierogies. That was good. That was a great meal. And we had Voss. That was a good drink. We had some kielbasa, so we'll have to get to our grill in just a bit. I'm wondering if the U.S. can compete against this time. Non-stick surfaces, again, are easily clean with a dish daddy. Let's move over to the grill. We're right now at about 59 seconds. This is the barbecue daddy. It cleans instead of with bristles with a continuous loop of stainless steel threading so you don't have to worry about any of the metal coming off of the utensil and winding up in your food. And because it's flex texture technology on the inside, you're actually scrubbing and cleaning with the power of steam. Stop the clock. One minute, 27 seconds. I think that's been our fastest time so far. So Poland wins this round, defeating the United States. They'll move on to the winner between Japan and the UK. Italy versus Greece, our next quarterfinal matchup. We'll start with Italy. Gravy, red sauce, that was a wonderful meal. Are you ready? Three, two, one, go. We'll start with the easy stuff. A little salad dressing. You wanna break down the oils that make up salad dressing so you'll use a warm scrub daddy product, in this case a dish daddy, that's clean. Continue with warm water to get our utensils. That way we get those clean. Little things like forks, you can get into all the little crevices because the flexibility of that flex texture technology in warm water. There we go, we're gonna make a mess cleaning up. Now to sanitize your scrub daddy products, most of them can go directly into the dishwasher. You can clean them overnight. If you really want to sanitize them, you can run them in cold water, put them in the microwave for absolutely no more 
than 60 seconds, and you'll have a sanitized scrub daddy to work and clean with as well. Oh, this garbage disposal will enjoy the rest of this. We had chicken and spaghetti. We had a great salad, red wine. Red wine could really stain. Oh, big pots like this, again, food residue, get that out first. It'll take more time to rinse this. One minute, 46 seconds for Italy. Now it's time to find out how well Greece can compete. We had another great meal. Started with a traditional gyro. We then had the classic Greek drink, Porto Colada. I got that right. We had hummus, a little bit of pita, feta cheese. Should be a quick cleanup, but let's see how they compete against Italy. Are you ready for the clock? In three, two, one, go. Hummus is basically chickpeas with a little bit of olive oil in there and some spices to add some flavor, but it's a sticky, sticky mess. That's where your dish daddy really comes into play. Because of the texture of the material, it scrubs clean quickly and easily. Here's our blender. Oh, the blender has always been my nemesis. That's the toughest thing to clean usually. That looks good. Plates come up quickly clean. In fact, it's faster than using your dishwasher. You don't have to worry about non-stick surfaces when you're using a scrub daddy sponge, or in this case, a dish daddy, because that flex texture technology was independent laboratory tested on 25 common household surfaces and is guaranteed not to rust. A little oil. More soap by pushing on the button. And we are done at one minute, 45 seconds. Greece is our winner by one second. Oh, that was a close one, but Greece did it. They'll be moving into the semifinals against China or Canada. And that matchup will be coming up in our next episode.